uh, it, it was an honor because uh, I, I've arrived to Valencia when I was 17, 18 years old. And of course, I play a little bit on the Valencia B team. So I really was for there for a long time and, and, and growing into the club and, and progressing into the club in the different sort of, uh, from a youngster to an experienced player in the first team, to not being a regular, to being a regular and be actually becoming a captain. It was an honor. It was like, uh, I'd say even like a, normal, uh, a dream come true uh, because of course, reason being signing for Valencia was to become one of the, of the um, just to be remembered in, in, in the future and, 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 and leave my mark in the club. And I think I've achieved that and, and becoming a captain was, was incredible. If I have to pick one goal, it would be the ones uh, against Atleti Bilbao, Valencia Atleti Bilbao. Uh, I can't remember the year, but it was in the, in the San Mames, in the old San Mames. Of course, always playing in Bilbao was very special for me, uh, not only because I was born there, but also the family and, and my link with the city and the club. But uh, of course, because it was in San Mames, it's uh, such an amazing stadium with such a great history. And I score probably, if not the first, one of the first of my kind of really special goals. Uh, when I got the ball from the halfway line and six again, I reached the, um, the box and cut back a couple of times and I scored a goal. So the goal itself, uh, I have to say, it was, it was really special in the way it was scored and, and, and produced. Uh, but also because it was Bilbao, I remember even some of Messi stand, stood up and was clapping and applauding me because of the goal I scored. So the whole thing was really special. Well, literally was like second by second. Uh, the moment I see, I think it was Ilio or Piojo with the ball up there. I saw myself at the outside of the box. I, I, I see the ball is coming to me. First thought is to bring the ball down. So I control it with my chest. As the ball is a bit behind me, I have to turn around. So the control is with my back on the goal. So first thoughts are chest, try to bring it down and turn. I, I kind of realize that I'm surrounded by Atletico Madrid defenders. So my instinct, uh, of course, goes to my knee. And my instinct tells me to kind of uh, like a sombrero. So I pull the, the ball up uh, and I turn around. At that moment, I realized I'm in front of Molina. Uh, and with the sombrero, I've left the defenders behind. And my only thought at that time, at that moment, it was just put, just target, just kick the ball. Don't put it in the stands, don't kick wide. Just call targets and make Molina work hard. And also because it was on my left foot. So I kick it and, and it went in. It was, it was uh, again, it was the, that was the process in my head like uh, step by step on how to try to be myself or find myself in front of Molina and, and score the goal. Then, of course, when I realized what I did, not so much on the game, but especially afterwards, it, uh, it, was, it was also very special, uh, not only because of the goal, because it was in the, in the Spanish Cup final.